All right. I look creepy like I'm a god because there's sun behind me just as well. Okay. I don't want to make this a long production. So I stopped voting years ago. I threw my TV out the window 20 years ago uh, because these systems are broken. And at some point you actually have to leave the system so that you can spend your time and energy building other systems that do work. So I hardly ever answer my phone to random numbers because you know it's going to be a political survey. And a day was the day. So I get an 18-year-old kid, because <laughs> I'm old enough to say that now, fuckers. I get an 18-year-old kid asking me these series of questions. I said yes to it. Why not? She asked, are you a registered voter? I said yes. She said, you know, how did you vote and whatever, or I'm going to ask you questions about who you're going to vote for. And I go, I don't vote for anyone. And she says, I thought you were a registered voter. I said, I am. Okay, that's mind fuck number one. So then she asks me a question about the PERS, Public Employee Retirement System, which I have a little bit of that money because I worked as an instructional assistant uh, for a while permanently. And, uh, I, and she asked me, in essence, uh, should we make corporations pay for schools? Do we think that it's because we're not taxing them enough that the PERS money isn't enough to cover that instead. That's what I got out of it, right? She wants to know. So I said, well, I don't vote. So you, get, you need to mark that category. They don't have that category. Well, then I'm just gonna say I don't know to every question, even though that's not true, because in order to not know, I need to know to begin with. So that doesn't work either. So <laughs> then she gets down. So I'm like, you might wanna inform your supervisor that we need another category here called I don't vote, because that's also useful information. Uh, and then, okay, so we continue on. And the next question is just like when you open your voters pamphlet and you read something this long, and even though you're smart, you'll never be that smart. And it doesn't even matter because this is just a hypnotic manipulative trick to make sure you don't think. All right, so that all your friends can give you their opinions, because that's usually all our ideas are. So we get that. She asked me this fucking long question, and I, or I'm like, what? I said, make a note. <laughs> I'm not an auditory learner, and a lot of people probably aren't. And even if they're, they are, they're so dissociated, they can't hear shit. I'm sitting here having a suicidal breakdown. There's a cockatiel next to me or whatever the fuck it is, like it deafens you, you literally lose a little bit of hearing every time you're near it. I couldn't hear it. You know why? Because I'm dissociated. Nobody hears these fucking questions because they're all a bunch of brainless zombies. I told her, I said, I have no idea what the fuck that is or what you said, and neither does anyone else. And then I said, you better find out. I go, are you an outdoors person? And she is. I said, good. I said, find out what you do best outside and prepare. Because one day this conversation I just had with you is going to make total sense. And she wanted to know my age. I told her 82. She said, that's funny because I thought you were a lot younger than that. And I said, I am. I'm 45. Because what really matters is your non-chronological age. <laughs>